this is Robin Ellsworth with Tridea Partners. Welcome to this video tutorial on how to personalize a grid in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. I will be showing you how to personalize a grid by adding a field. This option is useful because it allows the user to more easily view important information, as well as the ability to update the same field in multiple records without having to open each individual record. I have the Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 client open on my screen. For this tutorial, we will use the All Customers list page. The Personalize option is available on all list pages in AX. To access the All Customers list page, follow Navigation Path, Accounts Receivable, and in the Common Area, expand the Customers tab and select All Customers. The default fields for this list page are customer name, customer account, telephone, and extension. We want to be able to see if the customer has a separate invoice account associated with it without having to open the customer record and scroll down to the invoice and delivery tab to check. Instead, we want to add the invoice account field to the all customers list page grid. To do so, right-click on any of the column headings and select Personalize. Note that this option is only visible to users with the appropriate security permissions. This opens the personalization form. In the layout area, select List Page Grid and note the fields that it contains. With List Page Grid selected, click the Add Fields button. The Select Fields form shows the tables available which you can select fields from. Note that the field you wish to select may not be available to include in the grid. Expand the table containing the field you would like to add. We're going to expand the Customers table and scroll down to select Invoice Account field. Click the Add button. Select and add another field if desired, and close the Select Fields form. Now Invoice Account appears in the layout area in the position it will appear in the grid. You can reposition the field by selecting it and using the Move buttons. Let's move the Invoice Account field down so it appears as the last column in the grid. If you move the personalization form down, you can see that the invoice account field is already added to the grid. Click Save to save the personalization changes. In the Save User Setup, enter a name for the personalization. Click OK. Note that if you do not save the changes, your settings will not be saved and the field you added may not be present if you leave the page and then return to it. Close the personalization form. Now the field is available in the list page grid. This is especially helpful if you need to change this field in multiple records. Click the Edit in Grid button. Now you can edit the field for each customer account without opening each individual record, which can be time consuming. When you have finished making the changes, close the Edit and Grid form to return to the All Customers list page. If you wish to remove the field from the grid, right click and select Personalize to open the personalization form. Select the field you wish to remove and click the Remove button. You can also click the Reset button to reset the grid to its default settings. Close the personalization form. Now the field no longer appears in the All Customers list page grid. I hope that you have enjoyed this video on how to personalize a grid in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video and please check out the Tridea Partners website for additional information at trideapartners.com. Thank you.